Momoji, I don't think this is a good idea. You said as you slowly made your way over to said blonde on a pair of rollerblades. Momoji just smiled as always and went to grab your hands as you began to stumble. Don't be silly, Nimchan. How else are you going to learn? You see, Momoji had overheard you talking to Toru about what you would do with the others before she and Kyo left. Toru had eventually suggested rollerblading, although you never wondered why she ever brought it up as you now looked to your side and saw her struggling to stand, and you said you didn't know how. Momoji, being who he is, immediately bounced into the room, offering to teach you and not taking no for an answer. You sigh at the memory and brought your attention back to Momoji, who happened to be staring at you with a soft, dazed look that you couldn't recognize in his eyes. Uh, are you okay? You questioned him. He quickly snapped out of it, returning to his bubbly self. <laughs> I'm fine, Noonjan. Anyway, let's get started with your lesson. He smiled brightly, leading you to the skating rink and showing you how to move your feet. After a while, you eventually got the hang of it, until you noticed Momoji beginning to let go of your hand. What, what are you doing? You asked in a surprised voice as you began to hold onto his hand tighter and pull him a bit closer, your eye-colored eyes connecting with his sepia ones. It's okay, Namechan. I was just letting you get a feel of skating by yourself. He explained and began to move away. No! Don't you dare let go, Momoji! You said as you pulled him over to you once again, causing you to lose your balance and fall, bringing Momoji down on top of you your lips connecting. Widening your eyes as you took in the situation, you felt the hot sensation of a blush spread across your cheeks. It intensified as you felt Momoji deep in the kiss for a brief moment before the sound of Kyo laughing and mentioning you to get a room must have brought him back to reality and he quickly stood up. You touched your lips for a second before seeing Momoji offer you his hand to help you up. Grabbing it, Bringing yourself up, you noticed him looking away with scarlet cheeks. When he did look at you, he only met your eyes for a brief moment before looking down. S sorry Mim chan I- You cut him off with a light peck on his lips before turning away. Don't be. Was the last thing you said before you somehow managed to skate off, leaving a bewildered but happy Momoji. Thank you for listening to this, you guys. Um, I know it was really short, but someone did request it. Um, yeah, I'll try to post another one today, but um, I'm going to be in, in an orientation for like four hours. So yeah, when I get home, I'll see if I can make another one. But this was, I recorded this at like uh, 7.33 a.m. Uh, Pacific time. So you're going to be seeing this 12 a.m. Pacific time because that's what you guys said you wanted. But yeah, anyways, I'll... I'll <laughs> Mm. um i'll see you guys uh in a few hours hopefully um have an amazing morning have an amazing afternoon have an amazing evening whenever you're listening to this and i will see you guys when i see you guys i love you all goodbye everyone